What's up guys, Man the Roof Mars here today. We're going to be having a little look at something that I've seen a lot of guitar players do and I'm guilty of it myself, so let's check it out. So guys, yes, you may be wondering, what the fuck is he on about? Well, it's a little something that I've seen in a lot of YouTube videos on the interweb. Uh, also, a lot of them done by myself. A lot of them done by some of my favorite guitar players that, you know, tour the world. Doesn't matter what level you're at. Everyone's guilty of it. And you're probably wondering, why, why is this happening? Why, why are we talking about this? Well, we're talking about this because it, it really gets to me. Like I said, I'm guilty, and I'll, I'm going to give you some examples and proof of how guilty I am of doing this certain little thing. So what I'll do is I'll roll the clip, I'll play it, and then we'll talk about it. So let's check it out. So did you see it? Did you spot it? Uh, if not... I'll roll one again quickly and I'll zoom in on the culprit. The, the, yes, here we go. So there it is. Now, as you can see while I'm playing, whenever I'm not playing something, you see my hand reach down here to the volume, okay? And in one of them you see that I reach and I feel the need to do all three of them. The two volumes and the tone. I'd never even touched the tone. So what's that all about? So you're probably wondering why, why Matt? What's, what's the issue with this? Well, this is the issue. Even I've seen it even played live and people are playing it live, playing guitar live. They'll be playing, but then they'll go down to the volume button and just like tap it to make sure like the volume's up. And, and I'm thinking to myself, obviously the volume is up because you're playing, right? You're playing, so the volume's up. I mean, I get sometimes maybe when you're playing, you can knock the volume, but I, I don't see the high probability matter of that actually happening. Unless you've got a really dodgy volume knob that when it vibrates, it kind of turns itself down. I don't know, but I've spotted it and I've been spotting it for years <clears throat> and it's really got to me. I know, I know, it's pretty, pretty sad that that's got to me, but it's got to me, and it kind of made me feel I wanted to come on here, the internet, where everybody is, and see what the deal is, and see if you yourselves are guilty of, of such heinous acts whilst playing the guitar. <laughs> Now, I mean, yeah, I know it's not, it's not really a big deal. It's, it's a thing. But, but I, I want to know your guys' opinion. Some of you out there that are bedroom players, some of you out there that possibly, you know, do live shows on a Saturday night, or if you've got a band and you're touring and you're playing guitar and you're on stage and you're playing, do you do this? And let me know as well. I want to know why you think this is. Why is this a habit that every guitar player seems to have? I guess, obviously, not everyone, maybe. Maybe it is. I don't know. I've just seen it a lot, <clears throat> myself included. Uh, and I want to know what it is that causes this habit. Why do we reach for the volume button while we're playing? I get if you're playing and you reach to turn the volume down because you're finished playing. That makes a lot of sense. But if you're mid-playing, why do you need to reach for the volume? 
Or why, like, in that clip I showed you, why do you need to reach for the volume of a pickup that's not even selected? Obviously, that's doing nothing at all. So let me know in the comments, are you guilty of this? Uh, do you even know that you do this? Are you conscious of it? If not, next time you're playing, film yourself and see if you can catch yourself do it. And if you do, send that little clip my way to the email address in the description and uh, we can have a good old chat and a laugh at each other. And comment below and we'll discuss why we think this happens, why we think we all do this. So maybe come to some kind of like worldwide revolutionary conclusion as to why every guitar player does this and why we should stop doing this. So guys, if you're new, if you play guitar, uh, hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button, share this with all your guitar player friends, see if they can uh, chime in on what's going on. Uh, follow me on Instagram and as always, rock out, be awesome, comment below, let's have a chat and I'll see you in the next video. See ya!